holiday needs and wants. Holiday needs and wants. Good morning, Stingrays. Take a look at our Scholastic News for this holiday season. And I want you to think about how we just read about our heart full of things and showing gratitude for the things or people or feelings that we may have. Now we're going to talk about needs, things that we must have in order to live, and want. Things that we don't have to live, but we really would enjoy. Look at the big pile of presents here. Is a big pile of presents something you want or something that you need? As we read this, I really want you to think about what you need in your life and what you want that you don't need. And remember that we're showing gratitude for all of those things. As you read along, you'll see that the items are sorted into needs and wants. On the back, I would like for you to show what you know by circling whether you need or want these items. There are many, many people out there who have needs that are not met. And it is our opportunity during this holiday season to give to others. So if you find that after you read this, you realize you have everything you need, maybe consider what could you do to help others in need? And how could you and your family help meet those needs? I know we usually like to donate food or clothing items, um, things that other people might need to survive that we have as a luxury. So boys and girls, enjoy reading about needs and wants, but more importantly, think about how we can help others during this holiday season who might not have what they need. All right, friends, have a great day, and I can't wait to see what you need and maybe what you want. Shelter, a place where you can keep covered in bad weather or stay safe and protected from danger. Even this little house is shelter. Need, when you need something, you can't live without it. For example, you need food and water. Want. When you want something, it is nice to have, but you can live without it. For example, you might want toys. Dance break! Now take a deep breath in, one, two, three, and let it out, three, two, one. Now melt to the ground. Walk.
I guess so. friends now that you have listened and read along with the article you have done your brain break and you've learned important vocabulary that helps you understand needs and wants go ahead and take some time to complete your response activities they are optional however during this holiday season it's really important to think about others and these tools might help you do that. So take your time, do your best work, and we can't wait to see what you learned about holiday needs and wants. Have a great day.